Hi, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing my cash stuffing for my second paycheck of May and I think I'm going to be combining my regular paycheck and my savings challenges all in one video since I am stuffing a little bit only into my sinking funds and if you watch my budget with me, which I'll leave in the cards above, I had some unbudgeted expenses so it was a hundred and 76 unbudgeted so that's kind of why I have a little bit less money to put into my sinking funds but that's from my trip to the Finger Lakes and I kind of expected that to have um, a little bit of unbudgeted expenses uh, so that's okay uh, that's why there's a term called cash flow and essentially if you don't know what that means it's basically that you uh, flow your cash into what you're doing um, to cover the expenses of your trip or whatever you're doing. So that's kind of what I did. I just cash flowed it through my second paycheck along with the funds that I saved in my travel envelope. So if you are new to my channel, my name is Lauren and I am a cash stuffer, budgeter, and cosplayer. I'm also a dog mom and I live with three uh, roommates and we split all of the bills three ways. So that's what I do. I'm also a seamstress and that's what I do for a living. And if you are returning to my channel, thank you so much for coming back. I really appreciate you guys. And thank you so much for all your kind well wishes. I am getting better, but um, hopefully I don't cough. I'm still coughing a little bit, but I am getting a lot better. So without further ado, let's get into this cash stuffing. But this is my paycheck breakdown if you would like to freeze it and just take a look but very little things I have a lot of bills this time around and I think I'm gonna put it over here so what we always do is count the cash I actually got a little bit more more money from my friend because I'm watching his cat over a week and a half so he gave me some money and I'm super grateful for it definitely not expected but I'm, I'm super happy because um, it helps me out a lot with certain things in my sinking funds since I wasn't able to stuff a lot so you'll see I'll kind of go through it if I did put extra money I didn't I wasn't gonna make an extra video for it so I just put the money where I needed it he also gave me he also got me Sailor Venus and I'm so excited I'm gonna prop I can't decide if I want to open it or leave it in the box but I'm in love with it I actually really love Sailor Moon but I also like Sailor Venus when she's um, Sailor V so she has her like glasses in there too so yeah and then my last little splurge from April was this um, mini a7 binder which is now my new wallet and it has cherry blossoms and it's from hi hello budgets in Canada so I will definitely have her link down below she also has a um, channel as well as an Etsy so we'll get into that and yeah let's count this cash so we have 50 100 20 40 60 80 200 20 40 60 80 300 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 400, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So we are cash stuffing 418? Oh, yes, 418 today. And I'll get this set up and we'll, I will be right back. Alrighty, so I almost forgot my favorite Sailor Moon, so I put her here. And I have my lovely Laura Raptor piggy bank and I do have some change, so I'm going to put that in there. And that's it for that. And then, so these are my new envelopes. They're like cherry blossom and it's my same categories. So I don't have pretty much don't have anything left in my cash envelopes which is okay that's what it's used for so 
Create is going to get 25. How's everybody doing today? I hope you're having a lovely Sunday. Okay, so that's it for Create. Dining Out is going to get two tens. I did end up trying the mocha cream frappe from Starbucks. It was, I believe it was a suggestion from Budget with Bess. And oh my gosh, it was so delicious. Uh, thankfully, I still have money on my Starbucks gift card, so that's what I'm using. Personal is going to get 15 today. Gotta get used to these new envelopes. I might just fold them normally. We'll see. All right, so that's it for personal. And then, you guys, my challenge. Look at that. Do you see that? How thick that is? I don't think I've ever accumulated this many ones. And then my last one is receipts, but I don't have any receipts. That's it for my wallet. So cute. Okay, so we have. This is how many ones we have left over. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 ones for my dollar challenge, which is, I think, the most I've ever had. So I'm going to put that there to the side until we get to the savings challenges. Now we're going to start with my high priority cash envelopes. This is just kind of like things I use every day. And I did get a new sticker, which kind of completes my pink binder. I might put like little ones here and there, but it's uh, Listen to Your Heart. And this is a sticker from Bova Studio. I got some more stuff from her. So let me know if you guys want me to share what I got. Okay, starting off. Oh, I also got this, which is like, a little reminder it says remember why you started don't give up and then of course it says got it and remind me so it's just a little cardstock thing that it's also from Boba Studio I really like her shop okay so Enzo is gonna get his normal 20 and I gotta buy some dog food so this will be good so now he has 20 40 1 2 and then these envelopes are from Kay's wallet. She's always that link down below. And this one is for Enzo's vet appointment and it's gonna get 20 as well. So now he has 100, 200, 300 in the bank, 50, 70, 90, 110, 130. And no, yeah, 110, 130, 430, 430. Yes, that's correct because I did put like extra money in here from what my friend gave me. I hope that's correct. I'll, f I'll figure it out. <laughs> okay, and next up is Tom. I did take him out to eat at a Mexican restaurant and I bought him a cute little uh, card for his birthday. So he has significantly less money. I did put some of the money to cover some of the expenses for our date so now this is kind of like extra money towards um, our anniversary which is in July so now Tom has 10 30 35 36 37 38 dollars and family actually I think that's it pretty much um, I have to skip ahead to debt and that is going to be 80 81 which I colored in in my budget with me so but I'm using the made saver challenge so just go ahead and check that out if you're confused but so I'm adding $82 so 50 70 80, 1, and 2, and I'm actually going to add 50 more from what my friend gave me, so 
that's going to be an extra 50 so I'm going to color that in. I really want to get this done by the end of the year. And this all goes towards an extra debt payment um, towards my Chase card currently. And then if I pay that off before, it'll go to my next one. And I don't count this until the end of the quarter. So I'm just going to stuff that in there. Wow, it's getting thick. I can't wait to see how much we saved. And then that's it for this binder. Next up is my friend cat binder, which is kind of like little priority stuff. And I did end up putting $10 um, in Lauren, which I'm actually going to take out and put towards my savings challenges. So Lauren has nothing, Beauty has nothing, and then Taurus, I scratched off $5. This is from Hands and Bands, so now it has $25. And then next up, I did put $10 in socials. I'm starting that operation vacation again. I put $20 into socials, so now it has $40. Business, I put $10, so it has $10. Uh, Rencat, I didn't put anything. Um, and then I, planner, I put $10 in, so now it has $25. I didn't put anything in cosplay or anime convention. I really need to like budget out the anime convention for um, December. That's going to be like my last big convention. So I need to figure out how much I need to start saving because that's in Florida. So now we're all moving on to my savings and I put a hundred dollars into new cars. So now it's at 2,175 and I'm not going to be putting anything in here because I do have a savings challenge for it. Um, move out, I put $5, so now it has $115. Same thing, I have a savings challenge for it. Future is going to get $10. So now it has $30. Juki's getting skipped, but I did add $5 to it, so now it has $61. Christmas is getting $20. So now Christmas has $100, $200. One hundred twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, eighty-five, ninety, ninety-five, two hundred. 60, 80, 85, 90, 95, 200. Yay! That's great. Halloween, I did put $10 in there and I finally filled out my tracker. So I'm going to color that one in with you guys. This tracker is from Abby Tries to Budget. I think I'm going to do green. So I'm just going to color the outside of it. So I made everything in here. This is like create your own de denominations. She does have like one Halloween one for um, $225 I believe. And I decided to make mine all 10s and so it will be uh, 120 when it's all finished. So I figured I'd start this since I got like a little unexpected money and I really do need to start this because I don't want to rush towards the end. So there we go. One's all colored in. I'll put that back in there. Okay, and then emergency actually gets a prop 20 all the time because that's something that um, gets automatically put into my account and I think I'm going to be stopping this for a little bit so I can focus on other things because because I'm thinking I'm at a pretty good point right now and I want to focus more on my car so now it has 1,000 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000 in the bank, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. So 5,200 and I think that's where I'm going to stop for now. And this envelope is by Budget Cutie and we're going to color in one more envelope. And that's 
it for that. And then I have $4 allocated to my dollar binder. And let's see, I think I'm going to just put $1 in Wonderless, so now it has two. Um, one in, let's do, let's do two in coffee. So now coffee has $4. And then the last dollar is going to go into Tattoo. So now Tattoo has $2. And this is just little extras for like my super, super low priority binder. So any like ones that I have left over will get that. So that's it for the cash stuffing part of this video. Now we will get into the same challenges. Okay, so we're all set up and... I am just going to hop right into it. So we're going to start with yearly. And yearly is going to get $3. So I'm going to color in three. I was watching um, Cash Money Gabs. And she had put like a set amount towards... Um, savings challenges and that way like she if she had like mystery ones like she could do that like on screen with everybody and I don't know I think that might be kind of fun because it would be like a surprise so maybe I'll do something like that maybe I'll just like put a set amount of saving like money towards savings and savings challenges and that way like maybe it'll even out with my sinking funds because I kind of feel like I put a lot into savings which is I mean that's not a bad thing but sometimes I feel like it makes me kind of short on the sinking funds but I don't know let me know what you guys think so this is gonna get three so now yearly has which is going towards move out 100 200 50 70 80 90, 300, 1, 2, and 3, yay! So $303 in yearly challenge, and it's a 26 challenge, 26 week challenge by Chris Budgets, and I really like it so far. It's been pretty simple, and I'm not like going along with what is uh, like in a row or anything. I'm just kind of picking what's good for me and my budget for the paycheck. So monthly is going to be by Mystic Budgets, and I'm going to be finishing it today. So I'm going to be putting $45 in, and I did color an extra star last time. So I am not, I will be one star short coloring this time, but that's all right. She does have other ones out for June and July, and I may get the... Um, the June one because I think you save like $80, $80 for that one so what I'm thinking about doing is like the monthly challenge for for um kind of like either for envelopes that need a little bit more help or just like an extra little cash stuffing I think that might be fun because this one's $90 and I think I'm going to spread it out a little bit and let's do, mm, let's do this green. So I think that might be kind of fun. I don't know. We'll see. I haven't quite decided yet. I do have um, two bridal showers. One I'm actually attending. And then another one I'm not able to attend, but I still want to get her a gift. So I have to look on the registries to see like what I can get. Mm, let's do pink. So definitely this challenge was very challenging because uh, 
once I put aside money for this, I was like, well, I don't really have much for my sinking funds. So there we go. That's all complete. So thank you, Mel, from Mystic Budgets. I really enjoyed this challenge, and it was fun to do on my birthday month. So thank you very much. So that's going to be 45 And it should be 90. Okay, so we have 20, 40, 60, 85, and 90. So yay! The monthly challenge is complete. And then the four seasons, I'm going to be starting in June, which this is by Abby Tries to Budget. And if you didn't see my last video, I've been like sick in my health envelope. My health envelope was... Um, depleted so I decided to move my weight loss into health which was $65 and I'm just gonna not do this for now um, and try to maybe get some of the other challenges done before I add in a medical savings challenge but I'm definitely gonna be adding more into health because I think that's important at least for me so moving on to comment challenge so my comment challenge it had 50 comments, which I do each comment at 50 cents. One was 25, another one was 47 comments, and it was 24. I do take my Wednesday videos, which is usually like a budget with me or a um, haul of some sort. That's what I use for my comment challenge, and this goes to my car. So we're going to be putting a total of $49 today. So 20 uh, or 45 and this should be four yeah okay perfect this one gets me so excited because I never know what the amount's gonna be and I'm almost like if you notice we're in like the halfway mark so I'm almost done I wonder if it'll take me towards the end of the year to finish it that would be interesting to see how much I get just save just from talking to you guys and uh, I do um, count the comments that I reply to because I think that's just more fun so I really enjoy talking to you guys so I appreciate you and your support and your help towards saving for my car so now comment challenge has 50 100 50 200 20 40 60 70 75 80 85 86, 87, 88, 89, and 90. Yay! So $290, almost 300. Super exciting. I think we might reach 200, hopefully, next pay period. So that would be great. Next up is Dollar Challenge, and you know that's going to get these 17 ones, and I always count them at the end of the quarter. So it's getting thicker in here. And then this goes to my Juki, which is my savings for a sewing machine. And then $5, I didn't have anything. And then my $10, as you can see, I put a $500 play slip in here. And this is from Amethyst Budgets. So go ahead and check her out. This is the back. I don't think she's going to be doing backs anymore, but super cute little Hello Kitty. I had to do that one. And I believe I'm putting... Did I do something wrong? I'm supposed to have just two 20s. I don't know what I did. All right, well, we're gonna add three, thir three tens. I hope I did so I hope I did everything correctly. Um, well, I'll let you know on the screen if I do add it into here, but I'm just going to leave that to the side because I don't want to accidentally short some of my other envelopes. So we're going to mark off two. So that's going to give us 520 so far. And this $5 and $10 challenges are going towards my brother's wedding, which is in Romania. So that's it for this. <gasps> nope, I still don't know. <laughs> so that's it for this savings challenge binder. I love this so much. And I'm just going to put that up here. And we're skipping 
my mini savings challenges this time around, but with my 10 extra dollars from my Lauren envelope, I'm going to pick, um, not at random, I'm just going to pick a five of clubs, I think. And this is the savings challenge that I'm using for Amethyst Budgets card box. And I will have this linked down below, but I'm going to try to find a five of clubs so I can do like this as times two. So bear with me. Alright, so five of clubs, which is times two, which will be ten. And the what I decided to do with this box is put this all towards my um, anime conventions for next year. So that's why I decided to put my Lauren money into this box. Just because I could be saving it towards conventions next year. So that's what I decided to do. So there we go. $10 in here. And we have five envelopes done so far out of 52. So super exciting. Alrighty, so that is it for my video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope that it wasn't too long. I just decided to combine the two together because it just seemed a little bit easier because um, I didn't really have a lot of funds to work with this time. But I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please give this video a thumbs up. And let's find out what our question of the day is because I've been really enjoying your comments and thank you to everyone who did answer bo both of the questions because I was taken off guard with the first question. So thank you so much. Okay, so today is 22nd let's see, of May. Let's see what they got. Okay, so the question is, what is unique about this chapter of your life? Hmm. I think what's unique about the cha this chapter of my life is definitely YouTube. Um, I think that this, just being in the budgeting community and having my channel has definitely helped me save so much money. And I don't think I've ever had this much money in my life. So, and I never felt so much like security and like having funds put aside and not having to jump to my credit card to spend um, for things that come up or just in general buying the things that I like. So I think that's what's unique. I would love to hear what you, what's unique about this chapter of your life. And if you are not already subscribed and you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing. I would love to have you. I can't believe that we're almost at 300 subscribers, so thank you so much. I really appreciate you guys wanting to watch my videos and comment with me. So I will see you in my next video, and I'll talk to you later. Bye!